Hey guys, welcome, welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, I'm gonna be showing you guys how to link your focus to a certain home screen slash lock screen. So this is a new thing they introduced with iOS 16. That's one of my favorite things that they did bring is now you can have focuses with custom wallpapers with lock screen and home screens, and it's really easy to set up and get into. All you need in advance for this is a focus that you've already created. So just create the focus, add your custom home pages, and then all you need is your custom lock screen. If you want a more in-depth tutorial on exactly how to use focus, how to set it up, all the things you can do with focus, I will have a video linked in the eye top for you guys to go check out. But this video, I'm just gonna be showing you guys quickly how to link your focus to your lock screen slash home screen. As you can see, when I go to my control center and go to focus, I have a um, focus here called filming. Now I wanna select this focus so that whenever I turn it on, it will switch to this wallpaper here, or whenever I switch through this wallpaper, that focus will be turned on. So either way, it's gonna work with this wallpaper. So if I go into the settings for this, I'm just gonna quickly show you guys. I have certain people selected, I have certain apps that I limited, um, and then also for custom home screens, I made this custom home screen for filming. Now, again, the other video that I recommend you guys watch goes into depth about exactly how to set up your focus to um, have custom home screens and all that stuff. Um, so yeah, this is just the custom home screen that I created for this focus, um, and then, we're basically good to go. So you can either from here go and choose the lock screen that you want, but usually the most easiest route is just scrolling down and then when you have your lock screen, hold down to access all your other lock screens that you have available and go to the one that you wanna set up with your focus. And um, then you just click on this link focus button that they have here. Uh, if you can see it, um, and then you just click on that and then choose the focus you wanna link. So for my instance, it's gonna be the filming focus, but you can select any focus that you want. So clicking on filming, um, close that. And now whenever you switch to this, you will see it automatically turns on filming. So even if you scroll through all your lock screens, it will show you which focus is linked. So for instance, this one has reading linked to it. So if I go on here, my reading focus is turned on and it goes to my reading home screen. Um, so it's really easy to set up. Um, you just click on the link focus button, have it linked, um, and then you're basically good to go. Now, whatever home screen you've set up and lock screen you set up will now be um, what is set up when you turn on your filming focus. So your wallpaper will change and your lock screen will change, which is really cool and fun and just adds a lot more to focus and makes it even more custom. Um, so yeah, that is really all there is to it. Like I said, you can either do it in settings here from your filming focus, or you can just swipe down to your lock screen and set it up like that. Um, and it's just really convenient to do. Um, so for each focus, whenever you want to edit this home screen, you can just click on customize. You can change your um, lock screen and you can also customize home screen and change your photo here as well. If you want a whole different look to your um, your focus and then it will change accordingly. So you don't have to struggle with changing the look of your focus. You just have to customize the home screen and then you're good to go. So yeah, that is how you link your focus to a lock screen slash home screen. I really hope this helped you guys out and you can kind of find the gist of how this works. Um, it's a really cool feature that I really recommend you try out. Um, and if you did enjoy this video and was helpful, definitely give it a thumbs up. It really helps me out a lot. And definitely subscribe by clicking on the icon on the screen. Comment down below letting me know if you have any questions about this and I will get to you guys. Um, and click on the playlist to see all of my other iOS 16 related videos and click on the video to see my previously uploaded video. I'll see you guys next time. Bye!